Hey everyone, Myron here, and today I'm going to be talking about perfect shielding, otherwise known as parrying, and how Olimar can't properly utilize its benefits for punishes. Before I get into the specifics of it though, I need to give a little background to explain what the problem is. For those who don't know, Olimar smashes are projectiles. This means they'll always clank with another non-projectile attack, whether it be on the ground or in the air. However, there is a way to circumvent this issue. That's where desync smashes come in. When Olimar smashes are started, his Pikmin desync from his line, making their hurtbox active. They can be hit during this time and essentially soak the opponent's hit. Then they finish their animation and smash the opponent. This is a great way to get punishes on attacks that would normally clank with your smashes. In Smash 4, this technique also existed and would even cancel the death animation of a Pikmin, meaning if it died during the startup of a smash, it would always cancel and continue the attack. Now, I know that may sound a little wacky or overpowered, and I'll admit it's strong. However, it streamlined Olimar's smashes to be consistent when used, since you had maximum control over it. In Ultimate, desync smashes still exist, except now the death animation cannot be cancelled, and if the Pikmin dies, your smash whiffs. Normally, I would be fine with this change, except that it affects how we punish off of parries. So when you parry an attack, normally you're fine and won't be hit again unless it's a multi-hit. As far as I know, this isn't an issue for any other character. However, when Olimar parries, then starts to smash, the Pikmin desync from his line and activate their hurtbox. This means they can be hit. Except in Ultimate, they can die during the startup of smashes, and all you're left with is a whiff to smash attack. This, coupled with the fact that Pikmin have less HP, means sometimes full HP Pikmin can get one shot from an attack already parried. I'm not sure about you all, but that doesn't seem very fair. If a universal mechanic is objectively worse for a character, then I'd say that's a problem. The only fix I can see as of right now is to either change how Pikmin work in regards to desyncs, putting them back to Smash 4, or make parries deactivate the hitbox of the attack that was parried. My hope is that with this video, enough traction can be gained to show the developers where the issue is and receive an update to fix this. Thanks for watching everyone, and I'll see you next time.